In today's Your Healthy Family, along with the reminder to set your clocks back Sunday morning at 2 a.m., we're talking about managing the time change to keep the effects on your health to a minimum. Dr. Timothy Rummels, a board-certified sleep specialist with UC Health Memorial, who says people who are more sleep sensitive can struggle for days with a time shift either way, and there's data to back that up. For example, one article in the New England Journal of Medicine showed that uh, there's more heart attacks the first few days after the time change annually. There's also several reports of increased motor vehicle accidents the first few days after the time change. So sleep deprivation has real effects. And it's not just our physical health. Time changes can affect our emotional health as well. Dr. Scott Bay is a psychologist at Cleveland Clinic. And when it starts getting darker outside sooner, that can impact our likelihood of developing a seasonal affective disorder, also known as SAD. Now, SAD is marked by feelings of sleepiness, withdrawal, and even irritability. Research has shown that women tend to suffer from SAD about four times as much as men do. But... When men develop the systems, they tend to be more severe. And one simple fix can be light therapy. So look into getting a light therapy box or lamp and sit in front of it for about 30 minutes a day, ideally in the morning. Or try to be outside as much as possible when it's sunny and bright. People do is they stay indoors, and so they don't get ordinary light exposure. One of the problems is we're not outside enough. Even on a cloudy day, if you're outside for 30 minutes in the morning, you're going to get enough light exposure, and that seems to make a difference. Finally, as for easing into the time change, while it's always nice to sleep in, doctors recommend still wake up at your usual time Sunday morning and still go to bed at your usual time, according to your body clock Sunday night, to avoid feeling discombobulated on Monday morning. Good luck with everything. For your healthy family, I'm Ira Cronin. For more health stories, head to yourhealthyfamily.com.